Hello everyone, this is Miss Leia Ramirez and welcome to my class. Today, our topic is the DNA or the deoxyribonucleic acid. The meaning of deoxyribonucleic acid or DNA, it is a molecule that contains the instructions an organism needs to develop, live, and reproduce. Now, these instructions are found inside every cell and are passed down from parents to their children. So basically, ang DNA nandiyan lang lahat ng information about an organism. Lahat ng information sa'yo, kulay ng buhok mo, kulay ng mata mo, what type of ears do you have, what type of thumb do you have, is stored inside your DNA. And you can pass it down to your offspring. And the DNA is found in your cell, particularly in the nucleus. Nahikita ang inyong DNA. So these are the scientists who uncovered the DNA's structure. Take note, this is just the DNA's structure. And later on, I will discuss to you kung ano pang iba nilang na discover that leads into their discovery of the structure of DNA. So, basically, ang DNA, meron siyang building blocks. Ang building blocks niya is nucleotides. Again, ibig sabihin ng building blocks, ito yung bumubuo sa DNA. Nucleotides has the three parts, the nitrogenous base, the deoxyribose, and the phosphate. Nitrogenous base siya kasi meron siyang madaming nitrogen na nakakabit sa kanya. And it's called deoxyribose kasi sa RNA, Meron siya ditong oxygen and hydrogen na nakalagay. And lastly, again, it's the phosphate. So, again, this is your nucleotides. And, hindi ba lang natin siya na itura for easier understanding? Again, you have the phosphate, the deoxyribose or the sugar, and the nitrogenous base. Bakit question mark? It is because, yung nitrogenous base natin, napapalitan siya. Kanina, we have the guanine. Do sa image natin kanina dito, we have guanine. And for this one, nilagay natin siya na question mark because it can be an adenine, it can be a thymine, cytosine, or a guanine. So, may dalawang klaseng nitrogenous base, purines and pyrimidines. Yung adenine and guanine, they are double ringed. Yan double kasi dalawa, yan yung ring. And for the pyrimidines, we have single na ring. We have single ring. So, paano natin tatandaan to? Pag pyrimidines, may kita natin may Y yung words. Cytosine, thymine. Pyrimidine. Okay? So, again, ito siya, phosphate group, so the sugar, and the nitrogenous base, which is the adenine, thymine, cytosine, and guanine. Si adenine, lagi lang siyang pa-partner kay thymine. Si cytosine, lagi siyang pa-partner lang kay guanine. Yung T and A, made out of straight lines. And C and G are made out of curved lines. They are attracted to each other because of the hydrogen bonds that they form. Sa adenine and thymine, they form double bonds. And for cytosine and guanine, they form triple bonds. Okay, para matandaan natin kung ano ba yung na-form nila. AT2CG3. Again, AT2CG3. AT2 because two bonds. CG3 because of the three bonds. Si A, again, is for T. Straight lines lang sila. And C is for G. Tandaan yung kanilang curve lines. Okay? And this is how it looks like. Again, si A, ayan, straight lines lang sila, di ba? And they form two bonds. AT, two. AT, two. Okay? Tatandaan, si adenine, lagi siyang may double ring. Okay, and the CG, CG3, ayan, CG3, triple bond, GC, triple bond. And tatandaan, again, tatandaan na si guanine is double ring, 
Si Cytosine, single ring lang siya. And as you can see sa outer part, andyan ang phosphate. And then followed by the sugar or the deoxyribose. And medyo sa inner part na natin are the nitrogenous bases. And yung pinakagitna are the hydrogen bonds. Kung mapapansin ninyo, slanted ang ating structure. And that is what the, the scientists discovered. Na si adenine is for thymine and cytosine is for guanine. That is why it forms a structural shape na double helix. Let us try to answer this one. Again, remember, si adenine ay para kay thymine. 82. Double bond. And for cytosine, pa-partner lang siya kay guanine. Itandaan, triple bond. And try natin tong i-answer. Okay, of course, ito si phosphate. Ito si sugar. Okay, double bond siya. So, automatic. Ito yan. And, kapag ka double ring, si adenine yan. Okay, adenine. Itong isa, of course, automatic siya si thymine. And another so sugar. Another sugar. And phosphate. Now, let us try to answer this one. Again, this is phosphate. This is sugar. Triple bond siya. So, ito yan. Yung double ring is the guanine. And the single ring is cytosine. And of course, this is sugar and phosphate. You can pause at this moment para mag-answer nung iba. And I'll show you the correct answer after this slide. I hope nakuha ninyo yung answer correctly. And if not, you can go back from the first one so you can understand more the video. Again, this is Miss Leah Ramirez and see you again in my next class. Bye!